Hi Diamond Friends, it's Linda from Diamonds for Linda. Today I have a Craftably um, unboxing. I haven't opened these and um, I'm really excited. So let me show you the first one. So this one is A Light After the Storm by Judy Bergsma. And I, I was actually one of the customers emailing them a while back asking if this will be, um, if I actually asked if they had one of these, you know, in the warehouse somewhere, maybe they would, they, in the corner somewhere, but they didn't. So I was really excited when <clears throat> they restocked these and, um, I checked yesterday, well today, by the, I don't know if it'll be by the time this video, um, is up that but there was still some available you could still put it in your cart so hopefully by the time this video goes up if you have been wanting this one it will still be there so let's go ahead and get into it let's see i'm really excited about their restocks that they're gonna or not restocks but the new diamond paintings that they're going to have if you haven't um If, you, if you're not on their Facebook or email list or, and all that, yeah, you should you should hop on over and subscribe and, and all because they are going to have some new diamond paintings coming in. I sure hope that um, from here on out they are doing, doing well. Okay, let me get my little scissors. I don't want to rip the bag because I like to put everything back in. So let's see, how are you all doing today? Oh, it's been a little bit crazy, a good crazy though. Let's see, okay, so let's get this out. And let's see, so it has tape right here. Oh, and I can't find where it begins and ends. So oh, let's see. Maybe what I will do is cut that as well. Oh wait, I think I found it. Nope. And I'll do that off camera because I don't want to accidentally cut the canvas because you know my eyes. Okay, so let's see. Go like this. So it has this tape on there. Just go like that. Okay, so let's see what, so with Craftably, you get this cute little burlap bag, which I really like. You can reuse them for other things. And let's see what little goodies we got here. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you get random washi tape, and you get two of them. And I think I have this one. I don't know if it's from Craftably or another company, but those are cute. It looks like I have a 4th of July canvas that would go good with. And then you get your cover minder and um, this little cute container. You can actually use it so when you get square wax, it fits in here perfectly. And then you get their branded, branded wax. I love this because it, it, since it screws, it stays on. So I like that. And you got two of these. And don't forget when to pull this plastic back. Let me, oh, there's actually three. So there's plastic on here that you want to pull back before you stab your pen with it. But yeah, I like that these stay closed because you could use them for other things. And then you got your, oh, I like these right here. These square ones will fit in that container if you want to save them. So you got your comfort grip, your tray, your wax. I'm on two multi-placers. One's a seven and I think the other one's a four. You get some tweezers. Let's see. Yep, and these ones are nice tweezers. I like when they close at the end. Sometimes they don't. And your pen right here with another four placer. So I wonder if this is a three placer. Oh, no, it's, an, it's, just, it's a four placer as well. So, so that is your toolkit. 
<clears throat> excuse me, I got um, a slight cold, but thankfully it's not it's not um, super bad. I just have an itchy throat right now. Okay, so let's open up this beautiful canvas. So, you know what I was going to do? I was going to put something down on the bed so that way I could, things would kind of move better. Let's see. Let's just kind of roll it back a little bit. So, Craftably has poured glue, so you're okay with rolling it back. Look at I actually rolled it nicely. You know how I always have trouble. <laughs> So let's get this like that. Some of the drills. <clears throat> okay, so there's a craftably um, diamond painting logo. And then you have your chart right here. You have your number, your code, and your DMC number. And then on the bottom, you have their online, their guarantee, and all that fun stuff. And over here, you see that it's legally licensed. And the title and the little thumbnail, A Light After the Storm. I don't know why, but maybe it's because of my sister. She, um, Because she liked lighthouses. But lately, I've just been in love with lighthouses. <clears throat> So I just think they're so beautiful. So I was thinking, oh, like with all of them, I can't wait to start this one. There's so many canvases. I want to, I, I would love to be a faster diamond painter so I could get to my next canvas. Any tips on that? I guess multi-placing is probably is the key. And the bags, they, um, I love that they have like the picture, so pretty. You can always cut one out and then use double-sided tape or something to put in your log book. But they also have, here's their little craftable, craftably, you know, how to diamond paint and all that fun stuff. But they also have, oh, I almost got that off. They also have this one right here. A light after the storm. It's a 20 by 28 square. And then here are the stickers. They're each individual, so you don't have to cut them. Makes it so much easier when you're kidding up. And let's see. Looks like there's one AB. Isn't that just gorgeous? And then you get these extra diamond um, stickers over here. And then here are the colors. I don't know why, but I feel like out of sorts. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like this is my first video or something. I don't know what's going on. So those are the beautiful colors. So that is this one. So this is really nice if you, um, which is something I'm thinking about is is I never thought I would actually think about this, so I don't know if I will ever do it, but um, having the diamond paintings out of the box. So, because you know how the boxes do take up a lot of room? Maybe, I don't know, I wanna do a my stash video, which will probably be out in June or July, because I'm not sure exactly how to do that just yet. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, so I don't know, I was thinking, it would be nice if they were already all out. And I know some people um, to do that video would be nice too. But um, I know some people use hangers, like those hangers with the little clips on them and they could fit quite a few on one hanger. So I'm not sure. How do you store your diamond paintings? Do you store the drill separate from the canvas and then you keep it out of the box and do you hang them up? Do you, how do you store them? Let me know in the comments, please. Okay, so let's just find our AB. So it looks like it's a white and it's just a round circle. So let's see, I'll try not to get you dizzy, but here's some right here. So there's gonna be some at the bottom. I wonder if there's any 
There's some in her dress. Oh, that's going to be so pretty. And let's see if there's some up in the sky. And yeah, there's some in the sky. Look at those pinks and blues and purples. This is going to be so gorgeous. Okay, so let's go ahead and get the second one. So this one actually came in a tube. So they don't usually come in a tube anymore, but there are a few that are left that, that uh, have the tube. And so this one is the Guardian. So let me go ahead and take it out. These tubes are so nice and I'm so thankful that it's pink because I have a lot of purple ones. I would like a few, oops, sorry, a few more turquoise ones, but um, yeah, so that's that. And then you got your thank you note, which is always so kind. Can you imagine, um, she must have to do finger exercises with all the notes that she writes. It's so sweet. And let me get the, the tool kit. I took it out. get it over here without, without tripping over anything. My room's so small. Okay, I've taken it out because I didn't, I got rid of the box that the canvases came in. So again, you have your, your basic stuff and then a few extra things. You got, um, this so this is this one I did take out so y'all could see that the wax fits in here and I could even put the wax from the other one in here looks like it'll fit like four or five pieces or more maybe and then here's the washi tape one's a flamingo and then this one has watermelons that's another summer one that could go on a sum summer canvas and the summer canvas is actually from craftably as well it's um the fourth of July they don't have it anymore so let's just put all this back. Oh, look at this. This wax is not purple. The other one was purple. I guess this is a newer kit. So from the restock. So maybe now they're going to have purple wax. <clears throat> okay. So let's open this. Let's see. Oh, look at the tape has green on it. Oh, here it is. And let's see, I think I'm just gonna cut this off camera as well. If I could find my scissors over here, down my glasses. Let me put my glasses on so I can see. Okay, here's the scissors. Yes, I have older eyes, so I am over 45. Not that I'm, that's a secret of my age, but. Okay, so let's get this tape off. Oops, went right back on. <clears throat> Today is Tuesday, so I'll probably hopefully get this up Wednesday. Uh, and my, my daughter and I are going to go out to lunch today. Okay, so this one's upside down. I'll just go like this. Oh, yes, yeah, so let's go like this so we could get the... Um, So we could roll it back a little bit so again it's poured glue so you can roll it back the canvas is really nice i really love the quality of craftably um i'm working on one right now or i completed one craftably and i'm working on another one uh it's a whip so i actually haven't worked on it this month or last month but it's my second one that I'm working on, and I love the quality of their canvas. It is really, really nice. Oh, look at the girls. Her, um, are they in baggies in the other one? Oh, I'll have to show you that. So these ones, here, we'll just let this kind of sit for a little bit. Oh, I don't think it's gonna sit. Well, let's just unroll it. Okay, okay, hopefully it was, Put back a little long enough for it to lie 
somewhat flat. Eventually it will lie flat because I have worked on a few and they do lie flat. They are, these canvases are very good quality. Um, the plastic is nice. I love it that the plastic is thicker. So let's look at the drills really quick because I wanted to show you. I just noticed that these ones are in like the, the train, like a, the baggies that are all attached. And these ones are how they used to come um, in these little baggies. So that's interesting. <clears throat> and oh, my stickers. My stickers are coming off. So let's put these back. This is the other canvas. I don't know when I'm going to kick this up, so I don't want to lose these stickers. Okay. Oh, if they're not going on this pretty, so I'm not. Let's see. You know what I'm going to do is I am going to take off some of these. Of course, the ones that you're not going to use really <laughs> are sticking really nice. And I'm going to put these ones here. I don't want those to come off, so let's move that over, and then I'll just get rid of these. Put those on the side. Okay, so let's get the other sticker sheet. <clears throat> so let me take my glasses off again. So this one is 24 by 32, and it's called The Guardian by Katrina Colts, I think it is. Oh no, I got a cough. Just a second. <coughs> oh, I should have brought my water in. I couldn't find my, my water that I poured in this morning. Okay. So this one has 56 colors and it has one, two, three, four, five ABs. Wow, it's going to be gorgeous. Look at that. It's going to be a lot of greens and browns. But look at those gorgeous colors. And this one is, I can't even see. Gosh, you guys. <laughs> I'm so bad. Is this one a, um, this one's a square. Okay, sorry about that. Ah, oh, yeah, I tell you guys, I don't know what's going on with me. I feel so strange today. I feel like, I don't know, I feel like I'm missing something or, um, yeah, I'm not sure what is going on with me today. So this is, this is the drill. Let's see if we could see the, um, I hate to open this and take them out because I don't know when I'm going to do this one. I'm just trying to see if I can find some of the ABs <clears throat> to take a look at. Look at these beautiful colors right here. I wonder where those are on the canvas. So let's see here, five ABs, wow. So let's see, we have the white, a purple, a, like a mint and a green and a, like a off-white, super soft yellow coloring. So let's see, KT7 and I don't know, guys. I'm so terrible at this. I'm trying to find some of those ABs. There's a seven right here. I'll some throughout here for this greenery. And then that's no, that's not it. There's um, some ABs here. Was three one? No. Oh, yes. Nope. Not three. So, yes, I'm so terrible at this. <clears throat> and isn't that gorgeous? Oh, there's some more ABs over here. What about some of those purples? It was a circle that was half black. Look at some ABs throughout the face. And then there's some right there. Do you, oh no, those are G's. Sorry about that. Three, was three one? Three is not an AB. I don't know why I keep thinking that one is. What about that minty color? Let's 
I'm not seeing it. I didn't find that purple either. I'm just trying to find this one right here. And then that's seven. But I am not seeing it. Do you all see it? Oh, here's some. Is this a seven? No, that's a one. That's a one as well. Where are the ABs? There's, they're around here somewhere. Oh, look at there's that. Um, let's see. I don't think that's an AB though. Nope, it's seven. That's an AB. I don't know where all those ABs are hiding. Cause there's purple right there. So you would think there would be some. Okay, guys. I am just horrible at this. Yeah, I'm not seeing them. I really need to open these up and then let y'all know. <clears throat> That's what I would like to do. Like, I'm still not sure how I'm going to go about that. But I think when I, before I start working on one, I might go, like, kind of do a different kind of unboxing. I'm not sure. Maybe there's some here. Yeah, I don't know where they all are. They're all hiding from me. But anyway, that's the two that I got from Craftably recently. And I am looking forward to the new ones. I like that so it's not so glary <laughs> that they're going to get. There are a few that I would like. And I have been not spending, I mean, well, I have bought some new ones um, from that are going to be coming in. But I have been really... Um, not spending as much so when the time comes for craftably to to get their other canvases and I can get some without um, you know feeling like I'm <laughs> spending too much so I've been actually really good I haven't bought a diamond art club in two or three weeks so even though I really want that cupcake one and it was restocked so I don't know maybe I'll just grab that one maybe I'll use a little bit of points that I have to get that one so, yes, that's it. Have you got a Craftably soon um, in the last, well, last past month or so? And are you working on one? Let me know in the comments. I would love to know. So, this one reminds me of Bambi's dad. I forgot his name. I'll have to look that up. But, yeah. So it looks like there's some APs up here. And I don't know why I couldn't find those other ones. I'm sure they're around here somewhere. Well, they have to be around here somewhere. Yeah, oh, here's some ABs for the seven. And here's some more. I think some sevens are right here. I still wanted to find those purple ones, but. Maybe there's some down here somewhere. But anyway. Remember to live a life filled with color because it's so much prettier that way. And you all have a great day. And uh, yeah, sorry this video is kind of off. Hopefully it doesn't seem that way to you all. But I don't know what's going on with me today. So um, I will see you in my next video. Bye.